Okay, so Haiti is a country that's uh, about six and a half hours from, from here by plane. Um, it's the poorest country in North America. Um, it's got about 11 and a half million people. Uh, and it's been pretty battered. Uh, their history is pretty battered. They've got a lot of political turmoil and government corruption, obviously poverty. And then they've had a number of natural disasters, earthquakes and, and hurricanes and things that have really um, tore them down pr pretty good. Yeah, so the organization's called Partners with Haiti. Um, I've been on the board for almost two years now. My dad has been on the board for a lot longer than that. And they have uh, established connections um, between um, communities in the U.S., um, churches in the U.S. with churches in Haiti and schools in Haiti. The primary focus of the organization is to um, provide funds for feeding programs, for educational programs, disaster relief, and uh, building projects, uh, just overall um, connecting um, organizations in the U.S. with organizations in Haiti to pro provide financial support. So recently, Pastor Vaness, uh, who is a Haitian pastor in Port-au-Prince, visited the U.S. for our board meeting. He also came to TurboCam and spoke with a group of people. Uh, and he uh, made us known of, made known about a need in a, a community called Arcai, which is about 25 miles um, northwest of Port-au-Prince. And that community uh, is looking to drill a well um, right now, their people, the people in the community, have to uh, travel to a canal, which is about a 30 minute walk or so to get water. And so by drilling a well in this community, it would be able to provide uh, easy access to clean water for about 400 families and the ability to water crops and uh, provide water for kids in an orphanage there. If you are willing to donate, just recognize that it will provide um, access to, to clean water for a group of people that uh, otherwise don't have it. Um, it's something that we, we enjoy every day and, and probably don't think about.